Okay, so I'm gonna replace the speedometer on a 2012 Volvo S60 with a new style virtual display. Uh, we have it here. So, uh, this one is installed on a 2010, 11, 12, 13, SC60, XC60, V70, S80. So, um, all we have to do is to remove four screws, one cover, and unplug one connector. That's all. Very easy. Takes few minutes, as you will see. So, I'm gonna remove these screws from here. Got two. Now we have to remove the cover, just pull it. Oh, that's it. Just pull it forward and then up. So, and then just to, we have to pull that. Okay. And then we have two more over here. Okay, all I use is uh, 25 torque. So we'll see if it's gonna work without the software. So one more. It's a completely different display with three uh, teams. Sport, Eco and uh, Elegance. So all I'm doing now is trying to tilt it forward. Okay. So uh, tilt it forward. Now I'm gonna unplug it. I don't want to remove everything, so I just I'm um, being lazy here. Okay, it's out. Okay, old one is out. New one will be in. Okay, no time. Easy procedure, one of the easiest ones. So. Here is the plug, all I do is click it, put the new speedo in, in place, four screws, I'm doing this on my wife's car, we'll see if she's gonna notice, how soon is she gonna notice, because women sometimes they don't, don't really notice things on if it goes to the cars so we'll see if she's gonna appreciate my work upgrading her to a new speedometer okay <clears throat> again there's no software so from Volvo even only have it they have it for 14 models that come with analog uh, this uh, speedos so it's a hit or miss works or doesn't that's it I don't know we're gonna uh, I am gonna also test uh, one on a diesel uh, uh, from diesel that uh, was removed uh, from a diesel car on a, and we're gonna install it on a gasoline car. Uh, I'm waiting for that one to come. And we're gonna install it also from kilometers to uh, miles car. So it was on kilometers and then we'll see if it's gonna work on a miles car. 
if it's gonna display kilometers or miles or maybe that can be changed easily but again no software for, from Volvo whatever is there has to work right away so okay Okay, so so this is done, this is done. Okay. The speed is plugged. Okay, now the cover. Push the steering wheel a little bit forward. Oh. Now click it. Okay, here, here. I think it didn't go in how it should be. Why? What happened here? Oh. Now, I think Okay, something doesn't really go in all the way I'm gonna work on this later Okay, here Okay, here we have a new speedo and the moment of truth, okay, I'm gonna put the key in, wow, and it works, there you go, 2012 S60 with a new type speedometer, Detroit display without any software no software uh, was needed uh, and start the car to show I'm gonna change the uh, different I'm gonna change to different color. Okay, I'm gonna put performance. Okay. Okay, so everything's working. She has a check engine light, that's because of the tank emission thing. But she has some small leak. But uh, otherwise, it works beautiful now. On a 2012 Volvo S60 with navigation and you can see the proof it's a 2012 it has a shifter old style shifter only installed up to 2012 so uh, yeah it works no software needed uh, any questions you can let me know comments so uh, now I'm gonna um, Surprise her, we'll see if she is going to notice she has a new speedo. Okay, see you then.